guys, today we're going to go through an important strategy that you're going to need as we move forward in distance learning because as you can see, we are getting a lot of emails and we need um we need to be aware of that and we need to organize this. So what I did is I opened up my daughter's email and I noticed that it is a complete train wreck. Now, the first thing I'm gonna go through my daughter's email, which she doesn't have any, if you have any links that say Blackboard Guest, any emails from teachers from Blackboard Guest, please delete those. That's the first thing you should do because we will not be using that to log in and you do not want to get that mixed up with the new links. Now, the second thing that I would do, which I think is very important, is notice how I've put on here some labels. So I'm going to show you right now how to create a label. All right, so I'm looking, and the labels that I would recommend that you have in your email is Blackboard Ultra Link, which your teachers are sending you, Action Required, Completed, Waiting for Response. If you notice, if you notice under uh, her math teacher, we have already created a label and you can see that completed because she has done that assignment. If she wants to keep that email, we want to mark it. Now, when you are applying labels, please make sure you uncheck them after. All right, so, and I notice I used waiting for response for homework. So, um, if I'm looking, how do I create a new label? So I'm gonna go down to this email. I'm going to check it. I'm going to create, I'm gonna hit label, and then I'm going to put this response in that says, I've used completed action required, because this is a voting action required. I'm gonna hit create new. I'm not gonna nest it under anything, and I'm gonna create new. And then I can see that I need to do something with that label. The next one that I think that you guys should be uh, creating is the Blackboard Ultra. Your teachers are gonna be sending you emails, so you wanna keep track of those. So I'm gonna go under Labels. I'm going to create new, and I'm gonna take the Blackboard Ultra link. I'm gonna create new. I'm not going to nest it under, okay? Now, this really isn't her link, but I'm gonna show you that. I'm also gonna keep that link open. I'm gonna hit this label and I'm gonna to go to manage new, manage the labels. And here I can show or hide the labels. I was hoping that I could uh, put a color in, but I'm unable to. Okay, because if I was, if I could make this a color, I would definitely make it. Now, so then I look, Oh, so when I'm going through, I can find my Blackboard Ultra links very, very quickly. So the four labels that I would put is Blackboard Ultra, Action Required, Complete, Waiting Response. If I am not labeling anything in my Blackboard, if it doesn't need a, a label, delete it. Because right now, as you this inbox, well, you guys have use them in the past where you've kept all your old emails, it's going to become inundated. So one of the things I highly recommend is that you go and you organize your email. 